Okay, welcome to this video. I'm very happy to to be back with that. In this video, you see a lot of things. It will be very interesting. It's about Gokurikira and Gokurikiza. You will see the importance, me and the former trees, the, the teacher, Emeline, who will try to give you the best in order that you can speak currently, currently. It's also important to know that we give a lot of formation and if you want to learn more and more and more, it will be good. And in this video, you need to follow it until the end because I'm something that I can, I want to tell you about this kind of, of world and how, uh, how me too, I was with a lot of trouble with this kind of form. Okay, let's go. Gukurikira mukurikire uyu muntu aguhe ibintu unzanire Yikurikire ijyanka ntiyinjire ahantu hatariho Okay in this video you you received the answer of the teacher but I want to say it with you something because sometimes before was I wanted to know a lot of words. I was just locking the word in English and after in Kirundi and after trying to speak it. For example, Kurikira, Gukurikira, I took that like to follow, to follow. I can use that to, to say, to follow, I want to follow you, you can follow me, I want to follow this list, I want to follow all this kind of thing. But it's very important to know that in English and in Kirundi it's not the same. And it's what the teacher is trying to, to, to speak with you, to explain you. For example, if you saw the example one, uh, Emily was saying, uh, let's listen. Gukire uyumonu, gukurikira, mukurikire uyumonu, aguhe ibinu unzanire. You... You listen that. In the video, you can see that the, the, the people was moving. It was like, it was, it was living. And after me, I was there and she said to me, And she said to, to me, yeah. Mukurikire uyumonu aguhe ibinu unzanire. Then she said to me to, to follow these guys. And you see in the video it was moving. It's to follow someone who is living and to take something and to give him back, to give her back that thing. It's very interesting example. To understand, okay, this example it was yes, it's like the basics way to understand. After she said another example with some call. Uh, this example is not kire igangha niyinjire ahanu. Here she used it in other way. She said follow heat heat is is him her huh? is uh, call he said yes she said that I need to follow this call you know that they, they, they don't enter in a in a place a bad place and not good place and yes it's very interesting to see the way she used it that but it's also the way of yes to say okay to follow it. Now you will understand why I explained this part first and after the second part to understand the difference. It's not, you will see with the other example, you cannot use Gukurikira. You need to use Gukurikiza. And like she writes, like examples here, she said, is to go behind a person or a thing. And for Kukurikiza is to do something or to respect 
some things or to receive uh, to receive uh, law about someone for example not work you will see in the next example let's listen the the other next example and after also in comment you can give an example and to use it in in, uh, in sentences each uh, go kolikira and go kolikiza it will be good for you and also in the, the the people in the group you can write it in the group and we will we will spoke about it gukurikiza umukodzi mwiza akurikiza amategeko yakazi nkuko yayahawe gukurikiza umukozi mwiza akurikiza amategeko yakazi nkuko yayahawe mukurikire umuntu ari imbere yawe wukurikire umuduga uri imbere yawe kurikiza uyu murongo uri imbere yawe mukurikize ibyo nababwiye ibintu nababwiye Yes, like you listen with Emeline is uh, the first form is what kukurikira and the second one is kukurikiza. For example, in English, if you said, I follow the, the law, I follow everything that you, you said to me, you will use to follow. If you go on, for example, there are some uh, good sites you can, uh, sometimes I can, I can show to you. It's for example, Matana there. For example, if you write it to follow, it will say to you, Gokurikira. And after you, in the use, you will say, okay, uh, I follow, I follow what you said to me. Gokurikira, uh, I follow everything. Gokurikira, yours. Uh -uh. It's not good. You need to use Ukurikiza. And that kind of, I don't have connection, sorry. Sometimes it's all right. But it's okay. It's, you need to, to know that the difference between uh, both. I think it's not complicated. Uh, the teacher is, was quite clear. I think if you are interested also for formation, uh, in formation, there are a lot of things to know in Chikundi. That's why sometimes I took time to speak about that here. But I, you need to understand that it's not possible that I explain everything in, only in YouTube. It's something that you take time and to say, okay, to listen. Also, I will show you uh, another thing. The last thing is about that. The example... Uh, given by uh, Evelyn is like eh, mukurikire is to say it's like you want to say it, is to follow some someone mukurikire is like to follow uh, yeah something about class three is like umuduga the, the the car also in the example the previous example we said we saw something similar for example, to follow, I follow it, I follow it, and then mm -hmm. like to follow uh, some call. It's another one, uh, you can use it. And after, if we go kuikita, for example, go kuikita, you muro hongo, u mu kuikita, ijo nababki. It's like something that I said to you, some rules, some law, something that uh, I said something someone else said, and it's like to to, to, to respect. Yeah. I think I was clear, and I repeat again, it's very important to take formation. <laughs>